Memories of the past. This time of the year I think of my mother and father. My mother has been gone, oh my gosh, 17 years now. My father has been gone almost 10. I can remember as a young child my mother working at uh, Bell Telephone, which I think is AT&T now. My father working for Foster and Kaiser Sign Company. I must have been three or four. It's most likely 1952, and my mother was a carefree, happy-go-lucky person with lovely red hair, which I had too. She used to walk me to school and read to me at night. Made sure I didn't watch too much TV at night. I would always sing to my mother, and, and it was she who introduced me to rock and roll in 1955. My father loved country and western music. We heard a lot of Hank Williams and Fats Domino when I grew up. My father would sing a lot of songs he had learned as a boy in Louisiana, and also would tell me stories of the Old South. My father also cooked a lot of southern food. My mother, more California type food. I had the best of both worlds. My father started his own business in 1963, and that is when we moved from Eagle Rock to Glendale. And I must say my brother and I were wild kids and gave my poor sister a hard time. It was my father who showed me how to paint and my mother who gave me a love of music and bought me my first guitar. As I became a teen teenager, as I became a teenager, I drove my, both my parents nuts of my wild ways. That was even got worse with my brother. When I was 18 years old, I went into the army. But when I came home, I grew to love my parents more, more. My father did not have an easy life growing up. Neither did my mother. My mother lost her mother at 16 years old and my father when he was 11. My mother was 16 when she married my father. 16 when she had me. My father was 19. And I just got out of the army. I think became close to my mother as I grew older. When I married at 19, I finally grew up. I would only have my mother for 19 more years and my father for 25 more years. It seems as we get older you think like they're going to be there forever. It seems as you get older you think more of the good times than the bad times and when you become a parent you understand more why they did what they did as far as raising you. I wish now that they could have met my grandchildren. Then again, they may have known them in heaven and brought them down.